Hey everyone, in this video we will discuss about uh, profanity and its Python library. First of all, what is profanity? Here the definition is given. I'll just read the first line for you. Profanity is a socially offensive use of language which may also be called cursing, swearing or expletives. Okay, in simple, profanity is nothing but any curse words or any swear words or any bad words or any unparliamentary words are called as profane words and the whole thing is called profanity. It is as simple as that. Secondly, why we need to identify the same and clear? It's mainly because of uh, uh, the awkward thing it can create, right? Just imagine in any of your front end or in any of your analysis, swear words are the present means. Will your client accept the same? Definitely not, right? So, so to avoid awkward situations like this, uh, we should uh, uh, we should be more diligent about this. Okay. Thirdly, where it can be found, and uh, where and like can expect the same, right? So generally it will be available or it will be present in, in any chats, tweets or any in any social media comments. Mainly these are all the places where we can find, right? So as a data scientist, you may need to analyze uh, these uh, sentences, these uh, strings uh, related to the tweets, comments or chats. So that's the main reason uh, we are dealing with this library. Okay, here the library which we are going to use is called Profanity. The name itself is called Profanity. How to install the same? We can use a pip install. So pip install Profanity. I'm running it for you. It takes few seconds. Yeah. It says something like a requirement already satisfied because already I have installed it. If you are installing it for the first time, it will give you some of the logs while it's installing. Okay. And uh, okay, to talk more about this profanity library, it contains two main APIs. One is the identification, whether a sentence contains any profane words. Second API is the sensor API. It will just censor the swear words or just mask it. Both are same, right? Sensor or masters mask the swear words. That's it. Okay, we will just check the first API in order to use it you just you just need to call it from profanity the profanity module so from profanity import profanity that's it and to call the API profanity dot contains profanity so this is the first API it will check whether a sentence whether the given sentence contains any profane words that's it you smell like shit here as we know, this shit is a swear word, right? It's not something uh, we should use commonly. So let's see what it gives. Basically, it should give the Boolean or result, right? True or false. Let's check. It has given the value as true because there are there is a profane word present here, right? That's it. The first API is over. Second one, masking or sensor API. So to use it, we should call the profanity thing which we have imported here and then dot sensor API. Here, again, we need to pass a sentence inside of it. You smell like a shit. That's it. So now we should get the censored uh, sentence, right? Let's run the same and check. See, you smell like with some symbols, it just has uh, masked the same. So this is simple as this. Just try and use it in your NLP pipeline. Thank you, everyone.